as you start to grow as a live streamer, content creator, and YouTuber, one of the best things you can do for your community is give them the ability to use awesome emotes, emojis, stickers, whatever you wanna call it in your live stream. It allows them to hype it up and spread your brand, which is why in this video right here, I'm gonna give you my top five places to get awesome emotes. That way, your channel will stand out. Let's go. Also, full disclosure, some of these companies I'm about to list, I am an affiliate with, which I'll mention down in the links below. And if you click through, you help support my channel. Also, when you're down there, look for a coupon code because I may have sneaked one in there for you to save you some extra cash. Now, real quick, before we jump into this list, this list is gonna cover everything from pre-made to custom, from budget friendly to expensive and more polished. So to make it easier for everyone out there, I'm gonna list what's good and bad about each website and what the price points you can expect, all right? Now we can get into it. First, we have up Visual by Impulse, which sells at a price point right around 15 to 25 USD for emotes and package deals. The best thing about Visual by Impulse is they have great designs and styles with a polished professional look. You can also get the package deals for a good price point right around $25, which comes with emotes and badges sold together for that awesome price. If you go with their pre-made option, you do get the graphics instantly, which means you can load them to your channel. Once they're approved, you can start using them right away, which is also a huge plus. Now, the only real negative about Visuals by Impulse is the fact that uh, they have a really small selection when it comes to pre-made emotes and pre-made badges, which basically means there's a strong chance you won't find something that resonates with your brand for your channel. Now they do have a customized and personalized option you can pay up for. However, they don't list the ETAs, the turnarounds, or the price points of what they'll come in at. You have to submit a ticket, which I kind of don't like because I want to know in my brain what I can expect, which you will find in some other options we're going to list a little bit later in this video. Owned.tv is a great place to get emotes with a price point coming in around $8 for single emotes and to $50 for bundles and packs when you use their coupon codes. When it comes to the positives of Owned, the best one has to be the fact that they offer single and package deals when it comes to emotes and badges. Now, if you need a lot of graphics, bundles are the way to go. But if you only need one emote or badge because you unlocked a new slot or you're the type of streamer that likes to rotate things in for holidays or seasons, that's where owned comes in super strong. You can just get one graphic, one emote, or one badge if you need it. Also, when you're buying it, there are sales going on all the time. And if you go through my links down below, you can save even more money. So keep an eye out for those sales. When you get your graphics, you get them instantly from when you complete the purchase. So when you load them in to your live streaming platform, you can use them right away. Also, if you're into not really going for the full custom side of emotes and badges, they have an awesome template emote maker that allows you to have some form of customization that you can tailor a little bit to your channel. If you wanna learn more about that, I did a video on it. I'll put it in the top right corner that you can dive into to see the capabilities of it. When it comes to the negatives of own.tv, their graphics are good, but they're not as polished as Visual by Impulse or some of the other options we're gonna list here in just a moment. You do get a moderate selection, but still it's kind of small when it comes to the pre-made market. So you still may struggle to find something that resonates with you and your channel. Also, if the day ever comes where Own decides to get rid of the promo codes or sales, their pre-made graphic price point at their normal price is actually, in my opinion, a little too high. OverlayTemplate.com is a great website to get some pre-made and custom emotes and badges made for yourself. Their price point comes in around four to eight dollars for pre-made and around 35 to 70 for custom and personalized options. The best part about OverlayTemplate.com is their pre-made graphics are very affordable. You receive the pre-made graphics instantly. Like we mentioned before, you can load them to your channel right away to use. And if you're the type of person that wants custom or personalized emotes or badges, Overlay Template probably has the most affordable option I've seen that's specifically from a company. And probably the best plus about it is you get unlimited revision. So that basically means you'll get what you want at the end of everything. So what about the bads when it comes to OverlayTemplate.com? To be honest, there's pretty much none. However, I have noticed when I've used them in the past, communication can be a little bit lacking or spread out or sparse, but that may be due to me because I probably wasn't on top of it as much. However, I noticed the last few times when I emailed them, it took a couple of days to get back to me. Hey, but now the fact that you know that going in, I mean, you're fine. 
When it comes to getting pre-made and custom emotes and badges made, I would have to say my favorite marketplace would be Fiverr.com, where you can get graphics made between $15 to $45 per graphic, depending on what you want. Some of the best positives about Fiverr is the fact that you get the ability to work with an artist one-on-one, -on -one, which means they're gonna be able to produce and achieve an extremely polished look that's customized for you, your channel, and your brand. Fiverr by far has the biggest selection to choose from for pre-made and custom. There's so many different artists, styles, and skill levels out there that'll work within your budget. Fiverr also offers different price structures depending on what tier you go with. You can go with a basic, medium, or top tier that can work with everyone's budget out there. Fiverr also offers a form of buyer protection or customer service, if you will. So if you have anything that goes wrong with your graphics or purchase that you're doing, hey, Fiverr can step in to help you out. When it comes to the negatives of Fiverr, there's only really two, but it differs from storefront to storefront or seller to seller. Generally, most sellers only like to do two revisions. Trust me, you're gonna want more than that. Also, since Fiverr is the biggest marketplace out there for graphics, you're gonna get a lot of artists and storefronts that are just trying to make a quick buck. So when you pay for their service, all they're gonna do is take a pre-made graphic from a different platform and do a palette swap or a color swap on it and give that to you. And you don't want that. So you need to do your research and you need to do your due diligence to make sure you pick the correct artist. Now I've done a video on how to use Fiverr correctly and I really recommend you check it out if you wanna go Fiverr, which I do recommend. I'm gonna put it in the top right corner because that's gonna show you how to get awesome results. One of my favorite ones that I love to talk about and that's near and dear to my heart that I love promoting is if you're looking for custom graphics emotes and badges, look no further than the Twitch creative category. Here you're gonna find a ton of different artists that have so many different skills and talents that can help you out. And they offer great price points, generally between $15 to $75 per graphic. The best parts about working with a Twitch creative artist is the fact that they're extremely open to being one-on-one -on -one with you. They wanna hear your ideas. They wanna refine them down to give you a product that's gonna look fantastic for you. Also, you're getting an artist that understands live streaming culture, which is gonna be huge when it comes to refining and polishing your graphic because they know what's gonna work or not work on a live streaming platform. For a side kicker, a lot of Twitch artists also make your emotes live on their streaming channel. So you get to see your emote being made and you also get to offer live feedback. And trust me, the artists, the community, and everybody loves this. And when it's getting made live on the artist channel, hey, that's free publicity. That's free advertising for your channel and your graphic, which is also another awesome kicker. And not to mention one of my favorite things is I love art and I love being within the Twitch creative community. So I love the fact that you get to help out another Twitch artist. So what are the negatives when it comes to working with a Twitch creative artist? Well, there's not many, but if you're in it for the pre-made emotes and badges, you're gonna have a hard time finding some. Yes, some artists have Etsy accounts or Patreon accounts or Behance accounts where you can pay a small little fee and get that graphic, but there's not many out there. Since there's so many great creative artists on Twitch that make emotes and badges, that generally means they have a huge backlog. And I mean huge, like weeks out. Sometimes even some of these artists are months out, which means you won't get your graphics right away. So ask them up front when they can expect to work on it and the ETA for them to complete it. If you're thinking of using a Twitch creative artist, you need to understand that there might be a fluctuating price structure because if they become more popular, their prices go up. Also, if you plan on adding this there or that there, or you wanna make revisions, by the way, most Twitch artists only offer two revisions, you're gonna be paying more on the back end and they're gonna hold on to your emotes and graphics until you pay them. So you need to know about certain things like that where all the other websites we mentioned prior generally have an upfront cost that'll take care of all that stuff for you. Also, if I could address one big gorilla in the room is if you go with a Twitch creative artist, there's a strong chance there may be streamer drama that could happen where they get burnt out and take a break or they just disappear because of some drama or toxicity that happened within their community. I know it's rare, but I've seen it happen a few times and it usually means your emotes take a lot longer to get to you, so just remember that. These are my favorite places to get graphics like emotes and badges made. They're all fantastic, I've used them all, and I've all had good experiences with them, provided you do the right research and do your due diligence. Now, if you wanna use any of these services, you can do me a huge favor and use the links down below. Some of them are affiliate links, which means that helps support my channel. And also keep an eye out 
for those coupon codes down there because that saves you some extra money. Now, if you need to make your channel stand out even more, gonna do you a favor and put a video over here to the side that's gonna make it uh, a little more special. Don't wanna give too much away, but go ahead and check some of those videos out over to the right-hand side. As always, Wild for Games wishing you the best of luck. Take care, and of course, peace.